after the decision made by the general director of the IPS Universitaria to evacuate the new intensive care unit due to some inconveniences, the president of the Colombian Association of Architects explains in which area and why they had to remove the floors. It is important for us to communicate that we have been attending to and reviewing on the issues that occur with the floor of the ICU. Basically, it is occurring in a very small area, which is the nursing area. The floor rose due to the having sharp items such as the caster wheels of the chairs. This has exposed a situation that we had already had in the review is that some humid areas are presenting both from the upper floor and the walls that are generating an impact on the floors. We all know that the infrastructure has been neglected for a long time. We saw what happened yesterday and well that it takes its toll. These humid areas that are from materials that is exactly above the ICU are generating leaks at the level that are being transferred to the ground and generating more humid areas. Ayala is emphatic that the association is ready to correct the damages that have occurred in this area and is waiting for the order to go in since the ICU was occupied by patients. We as Colombian Society of Architects responsible for the war are attentive to the instructions for the government. Right now we cannot enter the intensive care unit directly since it's occupied, but we are attentive to be able to rectify the damage or fix what is necessary regarding the floor area. Basically, what we have on the chapters of work that we did not execute directly, but we was executed by a team of people brought from the interior. So that also forces us to have to work with the team that came from abroad and to transfer them again as necessary. We are attentive to attend and resolve this situation as immediately as possible, hoping that it will not generate a greater impact.